holiday shopping done online, which, as we've reported, could make you a target for porch pirates. But that's not the only concern with these deliveries. News size Allison Zimmerman watching out for those of you tonight with presents headed for your doorstep or maybe for one of your loved ones doorsteps. Yeah, Robin Elizabeth, it's a busy time of year for most of us out there, including those folks delivering your packages, many pulling long hours to get those gifts to you in time. But scammers and thieves are also on the clock. It's something we see all too often this time of year. Porch thief after porch thief stealing packages right outside your door. Well, it makes me angry. And sometimes it's even hard to identify if the delivery driver is legit. Like most of us this time of year, Kaylin Beisel is very busy. Work, lots of work, riding bikes, um, and uh, lately it's been trying to catch criminals. When he moved into his home on the west side of town, he and his wife added security cameras, and unfortunately, they paid off with this video from their porch. I got the notification, my hands were wet, and um, I was like maybe delayed three minutes and looked at the video and ran outside, and of course the guy was gone. Obviously, he was going for the for the mail. That's not his only concern when it comes to waiting for packages this time of year. I mean, we've received packages on 10 o'clock p.m. on a Sunday night, like sitting on there watching TV, ding dong. Like, <gasps> and so, yeah, it's a little, it's a little nerve wracking. Delivery drivers are working long days to take care of all of the presents out there, which means they could come to your home late at night. Well, I guess it's what they got to do to get the mail delivered. So. Beisel says his neighbors are keeping an eye out too. Yeah, all of our neighborhood is all bot cameras too. We basically have our whole block on. <laughs> it. yeah. it's, we have a mailbox cam, a front door cam, a back door cam. You know. Still, after seeing people lurk, he's considered other measures just to make sure his things get home safe. He's actually going to hire my sister. Like, hey, I'll give you 20 bucks to hang out from 2 to 5 o'clock because, you know. And if you do have deliveries on the way, here are some things that you're going to watch out for. The UPS did respond to an email to us today. They're saying all their delivery workers will always be in that standard brown uniform that you're used to seeing. But in some cases, they might be in a personal vehicle, but almost always they're going to be in a marked car that says UPS on it. We also spoke to the local courier today who works with some of these bigger delivery companies, and he told us this time of year, keep in mind those delivery workers, they're working overtime. They might be there as late as 10 to 11 at night to get those packages to your door. And on the rare chance that you are working with maybe a local courier service, they're going to call you to make sure that you're there before they drop off the pocket package at your house. Back to you guys. Great information, Allison. Thanks.